Hey everybody, welcome to Your Beautiful Table. Your Beautiful Table is a YouTube channel and a website all about how to help make your tables beautiful. And today I've got a review of Village Candle Balsam Fur Candle, so stay tuned. Hey everybody, welcome back to Your Beautiful Table. If you're new to the channel, I'm really glad that you're here. And if you're an old friend, an especially warm welcome to you. Hey, you'll notice that I'm in a new setting. So I have moved. We've actually unpacked just about everything. Only two things broke, which I think is a success. But gosh, that's what we did over the Thanksgiving holiday. And I hope that you all had a beautiful uh, Thanksgiving holiday too spending time with friends and family. So one of the things that we normally do is decorate shortly after Thanksgiving. I know many of you are doing that too, but we are going light on decorations this year just because of the stress of the move and having uh, two homes for, for a little bit. Although I think we're under contract uh, to sell our, our former home, so that's really great. Um, but uh, just with all that stress, we're gonna go really light with the decoration. I'm gonna do some tabletop decor. I've got some ceramic trees I wanna share with you, um, but more on that. But today we're talking about Village Candles Balsam Fir Candle, and I'm here in our uh, living room. Now, the leaves, the folks from the city have been picking up the leaves, and so I'm gonna talk fast in hopes that they empty, I think they're emptying their truck before they come back. They've been sucking up the leaves, and that loud vacuum sound has been like going on all day. So I wanted to get this video done in between their breaks. You know, see Buddy here, he's gonna join us and, and, and take a nap. He's got it all curled up. So the balsam fir candle is great if you're decorating or have already decorated for the holidays. It, this candle, I'll bring it up to you. You can see it's, you know, a classic small jar from Village Candle. It's a two wick candle and you can see that the wax uh, has that frosting that happens sometimes when you burn these kinds of candles. And the wax is this rich, deep uh, green color, sort of a pine, foresty green. And you'll notice around the top, there's only a little bit of clouding, but no soot really or any smoke. And this candle's performed really well. So this is an 11 ounce candle, and I think I got it on sale for $9, $9.99, $10 at a local grocery store. So Village Candle, you can find around. Now the cool thing about this candle is even though it's only 11 ounces, it offers 55 hours of burn time. So it's got a lot of that burn bang for your buck. Um, so a lot of uh, longevity in this candle for 10 bucks. So the candle scent. So it's described the fragrance notes are evergreen, bergamot, and fresh balsam. So I was looking, I love Fraser fir. Uh, the, my, that fragrance is what we have here in North Carolina for Christmas trees, and that is the quintessential Christmas tree for me. But I know many of you don't live here in the South and, and might have different kinds of trees, so balsam trees are also used for Christmas trees and um, pine trees are also used for Christmas trees. And so this candle might smell more like your Christmas tree if you live maybe in the western part of the United States or in the Northeast. But um, for me, this was a fun twist on uh, uh, sort of Christmas and tree scents. So the scent are evergreen, bergamot, and fresh balsam. I think I've already said that, but the evergreen, what is strong and comes out to me is pine. And so uh, it doesn't go all the way to like pine saw and get like cleanser, cleaning kinds of scent. It still stays in that natural pine. What it kind of reminds me of, if anybody's gone to like that E.T. ride, I can't remember where it's at, but like Universal Studios and stuff, they have like the E.T. ride sort of has that pine scent, that outside or, and I, they might not even have it anymore. Y'all comment below if you're like, John, you're so old. They don't even have that ride anymore. But they, um, that's kind of what it reminds me of is that, that pine fresh, but not like car freshener pine. So more sophisticated and nuanced than that. It really is a lovely outdoorsy, woodsy kind of smell without any of the dirt or smoke of like, it doesn't go to campfire with smoke and it doesn't go dirty like with earthy. You know, some candles have that earthy sort of flower shop kind of smell that's like um, like damp earth and it doesn't, it stays bright and more pine and pine oil. So just a lovely scent. Not a strong scent on cold. I'm having a hard time pulling out lots of fragrance notes when it's on cold, but when it is um, lit and there's a full 
wax pool, you get room filling fragrance from this um, two wick small jar candle. It wafts gently into other rooms. It's not obtrusive. It will not knock you out if you've got it burning in the house. And you can see that the jar has burned really cleanly. Sometimes I worry about these two wick jars because they get soot and smoke on the outside, but this one's done really well. One of the favorite things about this candle that I really like is the wax color. So this wax is a nice emerald green and when it melts into the wax pool, it is this beautiful shimmery emerald green color that's just fantastic. So if you're decorating for the fall, you could make a small greenery, you know, from either artificial or uh, real greens to shape around the candle, sort of nestle it into some florist foam and then build an arrangement around it. That would look really good. Or even having it out on a tabletop with maybe a red doily or uh, some sort of red fabric, a plaid or what have you underneath would be good. Or you could do all green and do a monochromatic or green and silver. This would look great. So just about any decor, this green balsam fir candle from Village Candle will fit right in. So it's got a great price point, totally reasonable, nice fragrance intensity and throw. The fragrance blend is nice, moves into more of that natural pine uh, sort of tree smell, not the Christmas, like in the classic Fraser for a Christmas tree, but still a piney green smell, which could probably take you like into the winter or if you like that pine smell, you could enjoy it any other time of the year. So it's a good holiday fragrance, perfect for Christmas time. Light it up and enjoy it uh, while you're um, celebrating special times these holidays with your family. The price point is good. The fragrance, uh, I mean, excuse me, the wax lasts a long time. And my favorite, the wax pool color is just, just a knockout. So overall, thumbs up on the Village Candle Balsam Fur Candle. It's one that I would buy again because it has a great price point. It's fun also to mix and extend scents from your more expensive candle. So if you have a Christmas tree scented candle that you enjoy, but it's a high priced candle. This candle is one that you can maybe burn in an adjacent room or in a bathroom or in another room that will help extend that fragrance and, and, and will blend nicely with other um, Christmas tree fragrances. So overall, great buy with this Village Candle. You can find it at uh, local retailers or online. I'll put a link uh, to it below. Thanks everybody for watching. If you like this kind of content, consider subscribing. We'd love to have you. See you next time.